hundreds of family photos missing for decades are returned. Last week, we first told you about the woman who found those photos and wanted help finding the owner. News Channel 5's Emily Luxon explains what started as an unsolved mystery ended with a new friendship between two Murfreesboro women. Jeez, that was at a country music telethon. That was, I think, maybe at Fanfare. An unexpected meeting results in a trip down memory lane. It was a, um, a wonderful time. Um, I think this was Vegas. For the first time in decades, Bonnie Nelson is looking through photos of her 33 years as a country music singer. This is when we were going to uh, the CMA Awards show. Each tour stop and performance was captured on film, along with the family and friends who were by her side. And this gentleman here is Kent, and he was my manager, and he was my guy for 26 years we were together. A photo album filled with decades of memories got misplaced while she was moving. These were really the personal ones I would have thought I would have kept. The photos ended up with Maxine Crisp after she bought the album at Goodwill. You had me from the 70s to 1998, yes. so 28 years. For Maxine, finding Bonnie and reuniting her with the photos brings closure. I feel joyful. <laughs> it's kind of like, you know me. <laughs> While Bonnie has moved on from her days on tour to run the Firestorm Ministry in Murfreesboro, she's grateful to have the valuable photos by her side. For you, I did bring you a card, and uh, I also brought you one of the uh, country music CMA cards. Oh. I was trying to think of something that would be special for you. That is. Now, as these two women move on to the next chapter of their lives, they'll have another special memory that they'll always share. Who knows what God has next? It's amazing, isn't it? In Murfreesboro, Emily Luxon, News Channel 5.